Uh, hey everyone. All right, so this seems to be becoming an annual thing, or every couple of years or so. Uh, I'm back with an update on Luke Ward Wilkinson uh, because it seems as though I am kind of de facto the leading authority on him, or certainly at the moment. Right. Um, we've got a casting announcement. Luke Ward Wilkinson is back again. Um, after Lord of the Flies and Luther and Doctors, he he's back. Uh, this he's back on stage. So, uh, theatre again. Um, Edward the uh, Second. He's going to be playing Edward the uh, Second in a production that's going to be taking place at the. Trying to do this without my glasses is uh, a challenge, but it's alright though. He's going to be at the Tristan Bates Theatre in Covent Garden in London, uh, playing playing the title role of, of Edward II, uh, and that is going to be, very soon, it's going to run from the 22nd of August to the 9th of September. Uh, that's, again, at the... Uh, Tristan Bates Theatre. It's a production by the uh, Lazarus Theatre Production um, or Theatre Group uh, Production Company. Which, um, okay, so he's back on the stage. Uh, yeah, because of course he d he finished the run uh, in Lord of the Flies. Uh, again, he played the lead. He played Ralph in that, and then things have been pretty quiet ever since. Uh, although. We've heard, heard from him that he's been thrown around, you know, he's been auditioning for various bits and pieces and trying out for stuff and it looks as this is the, <laughs> this is the latest development. Um, and hell, it's another lead role. <laughs> but uh, from what I can gather, um, well, this is a, an all-out uh, homoerotic production, which is kind of like... A dream come true for me. It's like a fangirl moment for me. Um, apparently, there's full frontal nudity in it, so I'll be, you know, it's it's becoming more and more tempting for me by the second. Um, we'll be having palpitations in the theatre. God damn it. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to throw that out for an update for anyone else who was thinking, well, we had this huge return with Lord of the Flies and then guest starring in Luther and Doctors, and then it's been quiet ever since. Well, hey, it's been worth the wait from the looks of it. Uh, so tickets are available now. Uh, I think you're going to be looking at about near enough £20 for a ticket, but from what I can gather, it's going to be worth it. Um... So yeah, that's in Covent Garden in London, uh, the Tristan Bates Theatre, from the 22nd of August to the 9th of September. Um, lustful, all all the sex stuff aside though, objectively speaking, professionally speaking, it's important to be professional right now. Um, it's great to see Luke Ward Wilkinson back in something, you know, it's just been a question of time. Um, great to have him back, uh, hopefully this will be you know, the start of, like, let's call it the next phase in his career, so hopefully, like, it'll do this, and hopefully it'll lead on to other things, but again, it's another lead role uh, in what I think is quite a, should we say, infamous theatre production. Uh, Edward the Second, of course, um, we've actually got a quote from Luke Ward Wilkinson. The articles I'm looking uh, at and the... Uh, website for the Tristan Bates Theatre, I'll link in the description, uh, but we got a quote from Luke again, let's uh, see if my blind ass can zero in on it, um, okay, so a quote from Luke Ward Wilkinson, I am extremely humbled and excited to have the opportunity to portray one of England's most reviled kings in one of the most iconic plays ever written. I cannot wait to get stuck into the text and discover this incredible play with the company. Uh, so, there you go. Uh, I think, yeah, this is going to be interesting, shall we say. Um, I think it's going to be an absolute joy. Uh, but, yeah, let's watch. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be there. I've got more than enough incentive to be there. 
Uh, if any of you guys are fans of Luke Ward Wilkinson, or should I say fan girls of Luke Ward Wilkinson, I would suggest you might want to see this. Um, but yeah, objectively speaking, I'm sure it's going to be a fantastic play, and I'm sure he's going to knock it out of the park. He knocked it out of the park in Lord of the Flies, and I'm sure it'll be much the same here. But yeah, I just thought I'd get back to you with uh, that update, and hey, please feel free to share your thoughts on it. I'm excited as all hell. I just found out about this 10 minutes ago, so I thought I'd better get on it. And I better, <laughs> better get this news out there. And hell, like I say, since it's so soon, I might have to get myself together and get things put in place and booped. Because I don't know how long these tickets might be around for. So yeah, be definitely going to see this at some point. Um, so yeah. Uh, please feel free to check out the articles in the website. I'll link them in the description. Feel free to share your thoughts on it, of course. And hey, if you guys decide to go, I hope you guys enjoy it. I'll probably be doing a review for it if I go. I did a review for Lord of the Flies. Uh, so I'll do a review for this probably in it. <laughs> By the sounds of it, there's going to be a lot of sleazy stuff to talk about. Um, but yeah. Great news. It it seems to be the thing now. Every couple of years we hear something about Luke Ward Wilkinson. This thing about him going off into the wilderness to train with Yoda. I, I think there might be something to it, you know. But hey, there you go. So there's the update. Hope you guys are happy about it. Hope you're excited to see this. Again, please feel free to share your thoughts. Thanks for sticking with me. Thanks for checking this out. Thanks for bearing with me while I gush. I'm sorry, I know it's not cool, but can't help myself. And yeah, thanks for sticking with me. Thanks for checking it out, and I shall see you all next time. Thank you, everybody.